What's going on everyone? My name is Raxor. Thanks for joining me on this lovely day and today we are going to do something a little different. We're not going to take any orbs. In fact, I'm just going to do this because this synergy is absolutely insane. So if you don't know how this works, uh, you are immune to attack damage while reloading and you do damage when uh, when reloading. So essentially, you don't throw anything and you literally just watch the game play itself. Uh, ooh, this one's interesting. Bottom bouncers and walls are extra bouncy. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna skip it. I don't need any of those. I'm literally just gonna see if I can get away with just these two. So, um, yeah. <laughs> so, as you can see, these fights are gonna be pretty trivial, to be honest. Uh, there isn't gonna be much to, to see. So let's go with some question marks that at least keep it interesting. Like literally every, every time, yeah, we go to a fight. Oh my God, this is this is busted. I mean, of course, um, there are a few conditions. So if you wanna actually get this in a real game, obviously it's not as easy as how I just got it. But if you can get these two, I mean, uh, if you saw, they are both common relics. So if you can get these two and then literally uh, get rid of all your orbs. Uh, usually you can get rid of all your orbs from some sort of event Then you will usually be good to go, right? So nice Yeah, these fights are oh my god. These fights are so trivial. I love it So there's only one problem with this build, right? There's only one problem uh, and there's one boss that can potentially just over overthrow this right all together uh let's go to the shop why not for my non-existent relics that i care about yeah i'm not even gonna take any relics let's just skip them all because i don't need to take anything i just keep going straight down they can literally speed run pickling like this this is great um we'll just continue don't touch trees guys you never know what's gonna happen um but yeah just take me wherever Again, the biggest part about all this is uh, there's one boss, and that is the wall boss, right? So this wall boss can ruin my day if I get the wall boss because uh, the wall boss will just one hit kill no matter what. Um, even this, like this boss is completely, <laughs> this is ridiculous. I don't even have to do anything. Nice. Uh, I will take absolutely nothing. But yeah, the wall boss will just one hit kill. So if I get the wall boss, I'm screwed. Oh, thank God I didn't get the wall boss. Okay, so I'm literally just gonna watch this play out because I can't take any damage. I think maybe going for some healing is nice if if you can kind of afford it. But to be honest, I don't really care. So like the only place I take damage is literally through the navigation screen, right? So. Let's see if... Oh yeah, we're good. We're good. So I also tried this once uh, before, but I actually failed because I wanted to do like a no orb challenge, right? So like I literally just don't throw anything, which is happening now. But uh, sometimes there are also events where you can duplicate... Oh, generator orb. This, this orb is pretty cool, I think. If you saw my uh, how to get the spin venture uh, video, then you'll know that I... I discouraged to get it but that orb is actually pretty interesting <clears throat> but yeah so as i was mentioning oh man this is so nice they literally all just die um as i was mentioning oh damn i already forgot what i was going to talk about okay never mind i don't think it was important anyways but uh if you want to hear my opinion on it just let me know i already forgot though so don't don't ask me i wish i could rewind time and just Oh, wait, I'm skipping everything. <clears throat> uh, yeah, so I only take damage from like other sources. Oh, I remember what I was going to say now. Sorry. Um, so there's an event where you can where it duplicates an orb. Um, and I accidentally ran into that. And I did have one orb in my deck because I was like, oh, I can just keep skipping it, right? But um, stupid me didn't realize that uh, I for completely forgot about that event. So I duplicated absolutely... I had to, you have to duplicate an orb there. So I duplicated it, I cried, and then I had to throw an orb. So I was like, well, that wasn't the build I wanted, and now the build's scuffed. So, you gotta redo it. So now we're back here. 
But this time, I decided just no orbs. I don't even care about the navigation. I'm just... Okay, I care when I take damage like that, though, but... Beauty, uh, thanks for the chest, but no thanks. In fact, let's just take the quickest path. I wonder if I can speedrun this in, like, 10 minutes. Ooh, I'm gonna rat out the chef. Nice. Oh yeah, even this fight. Thanks for the relic that I'm not gonna take. Oh, I'm surprised the main boss didn't come yet. Huh, I guess it comes after you kill all of them, huh? Or if you kill them one by one. Hello, boss. Goodbye, boss. And thanks for the relic that I will not take. Ooh, look at all my coins, though. Yeah, so I have some I have some ideas now for uh, more Peglin runs, but of course these aren't uh, I I mean legitimate in their own way, but they're not super legitimate. So again, these are more for like, entertainment purposes. It's not really to say like, oh, you need to do it like this. Hold on, I just want to see this interest. This is a new orb. Oh, this is a multi ball and duplicates hit ah three times. Interesting. So that sounds like it'll go really good with um spin uh crit fleece actually so okay interesting sorry i just want to see the new orbs um <clears throat> we'll definitely get to some some of the new orbs and new builds but yeah again so pretty trivial again this is the only boss in this the castle floor that you can get because if i got any other boss i would literally just die right on the bat so And I think all three bosses in the final fight. So there's a QR code boss, there's the mole boss and the dragon boss, but all of them do some sort of damage anyway. So yeah, let's see. So I have a lot of builds in mind. And if you ask me what I think the strongest relic is of all time is, it's this, it is round guard. Um, just because it's so strong, like, they, if they are literally about to one shot you and you are reloading, you just ignore all their damage, right? So, I think Round Guard is one of the stronger relics, uh, for sure. And I actually don't even think it should be a common. I think it should be an uncommon, personally. But devs, please don't do that. If you do that, I'm gonna cry, cause um, if I play normal Peglin, I want the orb. So, or sorry, I want the relic. So please don't uh, don't remove it from the common roster, please. Thank you very much. But yeah, I have a lot of other builds in mind, maybe like a Muscle build with Round Guard, just to see how large I can get it. And of course, no Bad Cheese, because the Bad Cheese will do damage. So, I mean, if I don't do damage, I will just build up Muscle or Spinesse. There's a few relics like that. I uh, will ignore it. I don't really care. I'm just trying to speedrun now to see if this is possible. And I'm, whoa, what is this? <gasps> I've never seen this before. Wow, okay, okay, I see. This is a really cool animation now. This is a new, whoa, what the? I, I, I get it, cause they're like, there's a tear. And you know what? I'm gonna go in just to, oh, just to entertain the idea, but wow. They, that was a really cool animation. Uh, good job, devs. That was, that was actually really sick. I actually really enjoyed that. And bye-bye. Thanks for the, re ooh, what's this? Targeted attacks can also hit nearby enemies in Aliens Rock. Ah, okay. I guess I see what this is. This is an ode to uh, to Tyler. I see. I'm gonna skip it. But interesting, interesting indeed. But yeah, we can just keep skipping here. This is. Oh, this <clears throat> fight will probably be one of the longer fights. Oh, it does actually scale up. Still nine 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 okay it's limited to nine i guess what is this prevents it holder from losing more than ah okay from any individual attack again trivial fight thank you for playing and that was cool that was a cool uh relic actually the aliens rock one that's a good ode to tyler if you guys don't know tyler then what the heck are you doing here? 
you probably know who Tyler is already. It's gonna hurt all of nothing. All right. Again, the great thing is it does scale. So over time it just adds up. So very nice. We'll keep just going down. I don't care where I go. Because actually, um, surprisingly the fights are almost as fast as... Okay, well, I need I need to go through, please. All right, uh, I'm taking more damage from this fight, th this navigation than anywhere else. Okay. Wow, lots of chests that I will not take. In fact, there's another one I will not take. Holy, holy, what the? Anyone see that? Uh, run away. Uh, look at this. Oh my God. So this would have been like one, two, three, four, five, six chests in a row and, and a shop. Oh my gosh. So I would have, if I was, if this was a normal fight, I would have just gone right here, just eaten all of this up. Oh my God. That would have been really nice, but interesting. You know what? I should have probably gone that way, but I do want to still see this in action. Thanks for hitting me on the head for zero damage. So kind of you. 200, 220, and bye-bye. Very nice. All right, uh, again, don't need any of these because it's pretty trivial at this point. And thanks for the relic I'm not taking. Okay, I am up against the dragon. So I think this will probably be one of the longer fights because I think dragon has 10,000 HP if I'm not mistaken uh, it is crucible level I mean th sorry there's no crucible so the the dragon won't have like max HP but he'll have some HP let's see let's see how much he actually has uh, this one okay I, I want to comment on this too uh, this is an interesting nerf uh, it used to be every seven coins collected uh, but I think this is an appropriate nerf because uh, I thought this was actually very busted. It kind of, every time I saw Breckening Crit, I would just take it. But I guess it kind of makes it a bit better. Yeah, this fight's going to be trivial. 10,000 HP will just go in no time. Very nice. <laughs> I don't know, This is this is very funny just not doing anything 400 460 i wonder how much i can go up to because i think he has the most hp out of every being right so what does it go up to 600 620 640 all right so that again pretty trivial fight so if uh you get these two combos and you have no orbs just uh just pray you don't get the the wall boss on floor two and you're good to go so if you guys enjoyed this video please don't forget to like comment and subscribe and let me know what other builds you want to see. Uh, I'm definitely going to keep playing with some of these builds, especially with Round Guard, and see if I can maybe get a huge Must Circle build or a huge Crit build again. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to play around and see what we can get. In the meantime, I hope you guys enjoyed again, and have a wonderful day.